You know, this is a perfect recipe for those power outages with that rain and with that wind, as you just said. So here's a look at that rent wind forecast during the overnight hours. Look at this. This would be the center of circulation over near the Eatonton area. 430 in the morning, 53 mile an hour winds there, 40 mile an hour winds in Athens, 50 mile an hour winds in Gainesville. I know you're seeing 22 miles an hour winds in Atlanta saying that's not, that's not bad. Well, look at this. It bumps up to 47 mile an hour wind gusts at about 630 in the morning here tomorrow and then 45 miles mile an hour wind gusts in Peachtree City. Thomaston still very strong winds there too. As that system moves up toward the north, the strongest winds move away, but we're still going to be dealing with breezy conditions in the afternoon hours here on Friday. That's why we still have that weather impact alert, not only for tonight, but also during the day for tomorrow. Now we know we can't stop this storm, but there are things that we can do uh, to keep uh, our families safe. I want to go to Doug Richards right now. He was with the state in Jima earlier and the governor 